Good morning, patriots, Americans, Christians alike. Well, you don't think the spirit, demonic spirit, has invaded the United States? Check out these crazy, demonic, and stupid criminals. Niles Taylor and was arrested in New York City for just setting fire to a total stranger in New York City subway. And if you look at this guy's face, you can tell the evil in his eyes. Hey, this guy is sick. 49 years old, was arrested. Richard Claff, a 20-year-old Indiana boy, shot someone in Kroger and then told the police, you know what, I always wanted to kill somebody. Well, I mean, no need for a trial now. Your mom just plead guilty eh? and uh, save the taxpayers a hell of a lot of money. And let's see, Oklahoma, a pedophile who gets convicted of messing around with a seven-year-old child is now declaring himself transgender and wants a new trial. I think he wants a new trial. Was he, did he want a new trial? Or he wants to appeal on the fact that he's trans. Probably so he can get into a women's prison where he can feel safe from the men who want to kill him and then go and rape the, the female inmates in that female jail. This is what we're dealing with, everyone. This is what happens when your government accepts stupidity. Where else? Um... Oh, yeah, let's see. We have this clown uh, named Hostetler. I want to say this. Nicholas Hostetler, 25 years old, goes around in the Calif somewhere in California. I think it might have been the Barrier or the Fresno area. Punches elderly people randomly and then poses for pictures like he's uh, posing and trying out for the cover of GQ. You can't make this stuff up. You can't make this stuff up. And my favorite one. A man in Michigan who was scheduled for a Zoom trial about driving with a suspended license gets on Zoom as he's driving his car with a suspended license. And the Ann Arbor judge is looking at him. He says, I'm sorry, sir. Are you currently driving right now? And the guy admits... Yep, I am pulling into my doctor's office right now. Hold on so I can talk to you. Pulls over. And the judge with a dumbfounded look saying, does this man have a license? He says, and she says, it's a charge. I know what the charges are, but on his record, he doesn't have a license. That's correct, Your Honor. Good. This man will pull into the county jail by 6 p.m. tonight and turn himself in. If he's not there by 6 p.m., he will be held without bond. And the minute you see the man's like, oh my God, I can't believe this. This is what we're dealing with. A, a sense of, I do nothing wrong. It's not a big deal. It's somebody else's fault. I'm going to do what I want. I'm doing it for fun. I'm not hurting anyone. If I did hurt someone, it felt good. Here you go. For all you people that want a secular society, who didn't want prayer in public school, don't want Jesus Christ of God in, at the center of the public forum, especially in our government and our schools, this is what you get. Because when you take out the source of all good things, crap enters. I will definitely have all links down the bottom in the description box. Check it out yourself. You really can't make this stuff up, everyone. You can't make it up. Keep the country in prayer. Jesus Christ is still king. God's still in control. And this is where you need your faith needs to be very strong for these next for the next 12 months. We'll talk to you later.